Umberto Mejia, a former Marlin. Five career starts, not a whole lot of luck. Yeah, 0-3, ERA. Lost his last start against the Phillies. Went six, gave up eight hits and four runs. Two quick outs for Mejia. Good start. The pitch is a swing and a miss. And Albies is down on strikes, and the Braves are easy for Mejia here in the first inning, one, two, three. Waskar Inoa, he's pitched great, just needs some runs to play with tonight. Yeah, you see his season numbers, 14 starts, four and five with a 3-2. Last time out against Colorado, four and two-thirds, two earned runs, two walks, eight strikeouts. Down the line and fares as the first base umpire, Jim Wolf, who had to tap dance out of the way of that one. And Cattell has a double. Some fancy footwork down there by Jim Wolf. Kind of hooks that breaking ball right down the line. There you go, Jim Wolf, and it's a fair ball. So suddenly the number three hitter is Dalton Varsho, and based on the way he's performed lately, he deserves to be there. Popped up left side. Will it stay in play? It appears so. Riley is there. And after nine pitches, Varsho is retired for the second out. And here is the freight train in the cleanup spot, David Peralta. Chopper out towards first. Freddy's got it on big bounce. Takes it to the bag, and that is out number three. Austin Riley, Adam Duvall, and Eddie Rosario here in the second inning. One-two pitch. Hard hit ball down the left field line. A fair ball. That was right on the line. All the way into the corner. Having all sorts of trouble with it. Peralta. Big turnaround second for Riley. Throws on the brakes. And he backpedals to the bag, and that's a leadoff double here at the top of the second inning. Now Duvall will be the hitter. A big strike out there for Mejia. That's his second. So two on now for Swanson. Fastball foul tip. Carson Kelly hangs on. That's the third strikeout and a big one for Mejia. Two outs in the second. 2-2 two -two pitch is popped up. Out into shallow center. Varsho comes on, the center fielder, and makes a catch. Contreras is out, and the inning is over. And Inola, after 22 pitches in the first time, could use a quick inning. Yeah. And a check swing and a miss, and Inola breezes through the second on a 97-degree night in Phoenix. Top of the order, and Jorge Soler, who grounded his second to start tonight's ball game. Left it out over the plate. Varsho runs it down. Two outs in the third. And here comes Freddie Freeman. And he shoots one the other way. That is patented Freddie Freeman. An opposite field single. He reaches for a 17th straight game, and the Braves have their second hit. That keeps the inning alive for Ozzie. Turned on that one, hit it into the corner. Freddie around second on his way to third. Ramos got to it quickly. Ozzie on his way to second. He'll stop there. Back to back two out hits. Second and third, two outs. And here's Riley, who doubled his first time up. Swing and a shot in the left center field. That's going to score two. Riley comes through with a two strike, two out hit. 91 RBIs in the Braves strike first. What a second half for Riley. Two doubles, two RBIs for Riley, two nothing Braves. Three straight Atlanta hits with two outs. And Arizona comes right back with a threat, a walk and a single, brings up Cattell Marte. Marte, that's going to drop in for a base hit. Vargas will score. Rojas coming into third. They'll stop him there. And it's an RBI double for Cattell Marte. They throw it away. And Rojas is home. Marte is out at third. But the tying runs come across. Atlanta a little sloppy getting that ball back in from the right field corner. And that allowed the extra run to come in. Now, Ozzie had to short hop that one. And that allowed Rojas to sneak in. Now the Braves are going to shift here with the batter Varsho. Varsho sends this one to the gap. And that gets down. All the way to the 4-13 mark. Varsho headed for third. Dalton Varsho. Hey, he's got the triple. It's a triple for Varsho with two men out here in the third inning. So Peralta has the go-ahead run down there at third now with two bounds. David grounded out his first time up. That kicks away, not too far. Contreras can't pick it up, and Varsho's home. It's 3-2 Diamondbacks. William Contreras, the backup catcher, had that relatively close to home plate. Varsho stopped halfway, thinking he was going to have to go back, and then the ball rolled away. Freddie Freeman singled and scored the first Braves run. Let's see how they alter their shift with a runner in scoring position. Swing and a shot. It is fair into the corner. 
Back-to-back -back doubles for Atlanta. They've got the game tied. Give Freddie his 79th RBI of the year. Hey, what the outfielders are looking for cover out there. Those balls are getting to him in a hurry. 3-3 game, nobody out. Swing and a shot into right center, a base hit. Freddie on his way to third. They're going to bring him around. Varsho's throw is cut off. Ozzie dives into second. Three straight Atlanta doubles, and the Braves are back in front. They had to come way to his left to come get that ball. Freddie was going to score easily. Ozzie saw it, recognized it. Smart base running. Three straight hits, and Austin Riley is coming up. Swing and a drive. Deep left center field at the track. At the wall. It's off the wall. Late break by Ozzie. He's chugging home. There'll be no throw. It's a three double night for Riley. And the Braves extend the lead. And Adam will face a new pitcher for the Diamondbacks. It's Taylor Widener. Swing and a drive by Duvall. Way back in left center. How far is that one going? To the concourse. Wow, a mammoth home run. Duvall keeps his hit streak alive. And the Braves have blown it open. 483 feet. Adam Duvall, that's the second longest Atlanta home run in the StatCast era, which is since 2015. Milestone homer for Duvall. And the Braves have taken a four-run lead. So down to third base goes Rosario. To second base goes Swanson. And Freed on with the walk. Here's Solaire. On the ground to third, tricky hop, second base one, and a first, not in time. Soler keeps the inning alive. Rosario scores. The Braves have a sixth run across in the fifth inning. Freddie doubled home Soler, the first of six consecutive hits in the inning for the Braves. On the ground, diving stop, ball pops away. Throw to first, throw it away. That's behind the backstop, a run is in. Freeman and Soler advance. Marte made a great stop, but then a terrible throw and another mistake that the Braves cash in. Braves have scored seven in the fifth. Here comes the pitcher spot now, and it looks like Jake McCarthy making his way up there. Jake McCarthy hits one deep to right field. Soler at the wall. That's gone. Jake McCarthy, a pinch hit homer for his first big league home run. That was a towering fly ball out of here. And he gets the dive backs a little closer, 9-4. to four. Brent the Gus deals to Eddie Rosario. Here's a 1-0 pitch. That is drilled. Deep right field, and that is way out of the ballpark. Eddie Rosario just took the cover off the ball. That is his second homer in as many days. And for the season, that is his 13th and make it a 10-4 lead. And they're at first and third with two down here in the top of the ninth inning. And that got away, and that's going to bring home another run. And the Braves now have an 11-4 advantage. Now the Braves a strike away. On the ground, Freddie's got it. Flip to Santana. Braves are three up in the east. The magic number is 11.